Right, come on in. Margie Simmons was ready to invite everyone into her home this Thanksgiving. Whoever's hungry, feel free to come see me, Rashida, or Yaya, and you will have a home cooked meal. Simmons and her neighbors at building 28 of the Marlboro houses have been without gas for two months which meant no stove to cook her Thanksgiving feast. It is a decoration. But that didn't stop her from whipping up the traditional sides, borrowing a toaster oven from her daughter to make stuffing, mac and cheese, and yams. The turkey swapped out for a smaller bird due to the limited size of her deep fryer. A welcome surprise for Simmons' eight-year-old granddaughter, Nini. They can't make turkey. At least they have chicken. Chicken has some flavor in it. You know what my granddaughter's going to say? I remember the year my grandmother didn't have gas, but she did the best she could, and it was good. And Simmons knows she's not the only one experiencing the hardship this Thanksgiving, which is why she and some neighbors decided to come together to share their cooking to make sure everyone in the building has something to eat this holiday. Our first priority is elderly first and make sure they get something to eat and have a good Thanksgiving as well. Colette James made a roast in her slow cooker to add to the feast, while her daughter found another kitchen to bake pies, a ham, and several other delicious dishes. Somebody opened their home for us to use their kitchen, and I think that is just awesome because they didn't have to do that. Neighbors said they could smell the cooking in the hallways and stopped in, only to leave with a Thanksgiving feast to take back to their own apartments. We are a bunch of strong ass women. We're not gonna let nothing and nobody stop us for what we need to do for our families and our children. Nature can't take the thanks out of Thanksgiving. And they vowed to stay on top of the housing authority to make sure the gas is back on in time for Christmas. Reporting from Gravesend, Joe Masiri, Pix 11 News.